Hey folks, it's on, this is Mahesh. So today, I'm going to show you a fast, easy way to play classic PS2 games such as this Draken Ancient Gates on your Windows 11 PC. So let's go, babe. So first, you need to get this PCSX2 emulator. Download it here at this site. Get the latest stable version. Install it and then restart your PC. Now you'll need the RAM for the PS2 games that you wish to play. So I go to romgames.net and search for the Dragon 2 RAM and then save it. Make sure to extract it using WinRAR or similar software. After extraction you will see this Dragon 2 ISO file. So next up you'll need to find a BIOS file for the PlayStation 2. Go to this site and you can download BIOS files for the PS2 US or Japanese or European versions. Just to be safe I got the BIOS for the US version. Extract that as well. Now open up the PCX X2 emulator and you see here the folder where you need to drop in the PS2 BIOS file. Now open up that folder and drop in the BIOS file in there. Now hit the refresh list button and you see the BIOS file in the list. Now select next. And here you'll need to add the ISO file for the game. Select the Add button and go to the Download folder and add the Dragon 2 ISO file. And it's done. Setup is finished and the game is available to play. Just double click the file and it should work. Now to find the keyboard bindings, press escape and go down to settings. Now select controller settings and scroll down to the bottom. And here you go. By default the game plays at PS2 native resolution which is very low. So to get it working at full HD or 4K, press escape again and then go down to settings. Now go to graphics settings and set these parameters. Renderer should be automatic. Set aspect ratio to 16 by 9 if you have a standard monitor. Enable widescreen patches and the one below that. Turn on bilinear upscaling. Anti-blur should be on. Internal resolution should be same as your monitor. Anisotropic filtering should be set to 16x. And FXAA should be on. And now it looks fantastic. Thanks for watching. See you later.